we keep hearing this reported as a mystery illness. So what do you know about it so far? So because it's so rare, we are still trying to better characterize what this condition is. But from what we know, it's an inflammatory condition that affects a lot of different parts of the body, including the heart and the blood vessels. What's the link with coronavirus? These children who are presenting with this inflammatory condition, many of them are testing positive for either a current COVID-19 infection or they have tests that identify them as having a prior COVID-19 infection that they've already recovered from. So how, how do you know that something is wrong? Having persistent fevers, typically for four days or more. And a lot of the features overlap with another condition that we know of called Kawasaki disease. And so some of these symptoms include rash, it includes redness or swelling of different parts of the body. Some kids presenting with this can also have um, stomach complaints like stomach pain. Are you doing anything different at Children's? We are developing a multidisciplinary task force and together we're developing protocols to better understand how we can diagnose and identify children with this condition and also how to best treat it when we do identify these patients. At least 13 states, including Illinois, have cases. Wisconsin health officials told 12 News they have not received any reports of the illness in the state. More